If you are joining me, share this on your wall, please. Timio, na me ni da sonu. Timio, na wuye mi gwa nko biya. Ewa di ma wuye ye mo brena ma ba. Me di me ni etu usu. Ewa di timi. Yes, God. 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 Thank you for joining. Thank you for joining. Thank you for joining me. God bless you for joining me. God bless you for joining me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. And never be a young Tiasian and when you're missing me down at the intro. And never be a face I had no man and then you're missing me down at the intro. Now who will be a witch in a warrior for and will be a pretty hour in Jay. You make a foul. Kind you. Kind you. Erradi. Oh. Erradi by Kawati. Kind you. I just love you. Me and me, I love you. I read the one in my comments. So I did not pay boy mo. So I go pump up the lip and you never make me pay money. I go pump money. I watch the walk as I am in the city. I read my news. So I did not pay money. So me and go pump up the lip and you never make me pay money. I watch the walk as I am in the city. I read my news. So I did not pay money. So me and go pump up the lip and you never make me pay money. Hey, come here. Where is my Kuma Swadi? Oh, I'm so hungry. Kuma Swadi. Where is ah? So I joined me a show on what? And when you're missing me, I want to ask me if I worry any worry, Jai. Me worry dear, the minimum in Tinian could pause me on Cassa Sim Winnie. Me worry, there's a minimum in Tinian could pause me no one chess as Sim Win. So what join the audience share or war on what it? Now, baby, you know, baby, and she that. Obey, who said, Bonnie, be when you cross, so I did go in the cross or don't wish him. Obey, who said, did go in the cross, so would be a chip, and then be a whom in the cross or the whom poker shimmy. Within your tobacco, and a tea is our program way. Na so be jaya wari abe timi akas wa kambi ya chile no. So be preso be jano umu emusu a odine hu tu. O Howard ne unko akushima wa hu. Nyabo trena timi ene ewiya we. Me de minim di ewu kono minim di e tu oba de me kato sa u power di jaya ebe ya shiye. If sa wari e onyami ni jono nyami nyango pon e chile wari jaya. So wa jono mi a de she wa wa no. Na ubi yuso NTB no no so unka bin chile ubi. Si nyami ya sami ya chana kakra kakra na duni penyu na aso. Mi nyami kaimiu. Ah. Eh kaimiu. We ni maku maswadiye. Maku maswadiye sen kenyan kopo meni penyu na atina samasi. Maku maswadiye sen kenyan bemu wa hune ni mo nyam. Maku maswadiye sen kenyan bemu yine huwa diya chila ho. Makuma so is an ka obeti nyame asem aso na wonye bone ema bon nsam nyawo Makuma so is an ka obehu die nyankop obese oka ewo twene konkuru nimu Awade nka ho anopa bo isu adwane mia che wo wo no ate ma obi nsu enye bi ntie ma obi nsu nka nkyere obi ma obi hu sampa se nyame bi a ye fere nyame nyame ye nim de opa che ewa ware semu afa wo ti ase awi a obehu ni a onyankop on e kasa fa ware ni ene ware jaye Eraden kai wo swa warrior, Eraden kai wo. Oma wo kujo, Oma o tumi, 
Oma hon hon wabe timi ya chuma wari ya sina wong pere a wari jaye hon. En a wajaye dani yusu a wubiye nong. Ya koso hwe. Ni ya beti ni fi. Ewa den ka oma wong. Oma wong. Oma wong nyan sembi ya hon. Wokon po ndo a wari jaye. Wokon em do a wari jaye. Sain yin geli sain nyan sa mese nyan kopo oso mong. Bi soa joni mi ya she wa wong nong. Soa joni mi. Oli ya she wa wong nong. Because they were powerful, powerful teachings. My conducting now, and they have been telling me, and they have been telling me, and some are not one. When you're missing me, no one just send me a far away. Now, so I'm so worried. I know I am who I say, and maybe the dozen of us are and brand of a son. And maybe the bowels of us are a son of a city. If so, you are by you are Bible says, Nick, I worry you. Same punching and watching. As in a drama, one hour board, my yearly pain, my friend, my chum. But my catcher will say, So wouldn't you mind if I saw soon? The one who may be also to an offer. Bible is in the pain, you never saw the Casabo Media and Sentinel. There's a blue enemy young for my friend here. Media, my master, my prophecy, the shell come on about my basset, maybe a cutting young couple of Casafa, Bible Chen, who corner them be also for penny, and the channel will just see at home. The plan watching. The Biako just saw them out. The pastor will say, You do swear, take your man as your husband. You say, Yes, I do. Do you understand that oath that you're taking? If you just join me, share this on your wall. So, what join me? I would share your wall. Kai, yo. When you make a man, I just kai, yo. Minya, me, kai, yo. Cherry and Pony, I'm a guy, me oh. When he makuma sodi, ah, makuma sodi, I say, come and get jiggy boy, Pony, me mu. Makuma sodi, I say, I go home, my jamai, I come and win, I go pon sodi, I want here. Makuma sodi, I say, I go home, my friend, I'm me, I go cry, no one change, kwa. Our lady, I won't share me. I no be, I won't change, kwa. I no be, I won't jai, I want here. Bible no can want some clear in the TNE. What do you share? Maybe we are in the late me jump to the church later. Share what one? Oh, how excellent! How excellent is your name? How excellent! How excellent! How excellent is your name? How beautiful! How beautiful! How beautiful is your name? How beautiful, how beautiful, how beautiful, how beautiful is your name? When you meet me at dinner, you're fair. A demon is a rohi, a demon is a rohi, a demon is a adona, a demon is a jarel. My God, my God, my God, my God, my God. Sure, so what you would give you a whole poem, who would give you a whole poem, said Dino. Demon, this one boss said dinner with Janet. If you could never saw a several one in us, one boss said dinner, said demon or pretty fast. Hmm, 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 hmm. So what is said dinner, snow boss said dinner, may say. And no baby ever would be sorry. Why are you for to me sorry for him? Pem. Will be any friend to me to the air, and you have a sap upon the edge of your own chili, and in your pet. Now I'm from. And then I say, so what are you? Timmy. So what are you? So now what champion? Timmy. And I say, what are you? Now what giant swa? She is. You say, what you are going to do? A dangerous thing will be done. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Is your name? How beautiful? How beautiful? How beautiful is your name? Oh, how beautiful! How beautiful! How beautiful is your name? If you just join me, share this on your wall, please. If you just join me, share this on your wall. Let somebody also be a partaker. Let somebody also have an interest. Let somebody also enjoy in what I'm about to share with you. I have only two sheets over here. Only two copies I have here, which I made my research. Regarding what the Bible said, what the Lord said in this Bible. That's what I'm here to talk to you about. How beautiful, how beautiful, 
How beautiful is your name? My God. How excellent, how excellent, how excellent is your name. How beautiful, how beautiful, how beautiful is your name. Che. Sometimes the beautiful thing is say, I am like I'm doing this for fun. I'm not doing this for fun. No. Even for fun. I know my way out to enjoy myself, to do what will make my heart my heart happy. But let me tell you, the happiness on this earth has nothing to offer me. The happiness on this earth is only pain, tear, disappointment, sorrows. But the happiness in heaven is what I am working towards. The happiness in heaven where I am going to rest is what I am fighting for. The happiness in the throne where I will sit and I will relax in my comfortable zone is what I am crying for. Not the happiness of a car, not the happiness of money, not the happiness of mammon, not the happiness of prostitution, not the happiness of adultery, not the happiness of the criminal things, not the happiness of things that is not godly, but the happiness that I can enjoy the kingdom, the happiness that I can enjoy God's blessing. The happiness that I can enjoy life after death. That's what I'm here for. Maybe you know me those years. Who I used to be. That boy. Yes, that's me. But let me tell you. If God appoints you to do his work. Let me tell you. You will be poor. But because of the blessing, the favor upon your life. People will see you and they will still think you are rich. If God appoints you in his own appointed time, the people who see you to be rich all the time in that life will still see you as a rich man. And they will not know your source of income. Because let me tell you, if the blessing of the Lord come upon your life, the enemy will try, their weapons will fight, but the Lord who has brought you out from that darkness will let the light Bright upon your life. And everything that you lay your hands on will be a fruitful thing. Will be a blessing to you. This morning, this afternoon, wherever you're watching me from. The Bible says to talk to you about marriage and divorce. And it's what? Instructions. The book of Genesis 2 verse, what, verse 18. I said, the Lord God said, it's not good for a man to be alone. I will make a helper. Suitable for him. 23. Then man said, This now is what? My bones are fresh. After God said that, I have created everything. And I have created this and that and that and that. I have to also what? Create a man. Somebody who will take control over what I have created. And the Bible says, Jesus, God Almighty stood up and said, let us create a human. Let us create a man. Yambo, yambo onipa. Wankasami mo onipa o. I said, yambo onipa. Who were they? Who, were, who was he working with? He was working with the God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. He said, let's work together and create a human. And the Bible said they created a human. And after the human raised up from, the, from, from, from where God created that human, the man said, you have created everything into two. You have created everything into two. And the Bible said, now Bible say, and put Adam Busa as a friend and crop on him. When you make say, yeah, Adam Busa was so a day, must be a man. Now Bible say, Brian Boy, if we are not Adam Madonna Hall. Now I'm sorry, and some Adam crying in verse 23. I say, The man said, This is now 
my bone of what? My flesh. This is the bone of my flesh. A brother, I'm sorry free, and never when you go in the film part of the ball, bar. Was only the uncle's ampa. When me wanna mo honam, me film on party. Me don't pay me don't pay me. Not just a new concept, but my own kwa wona nte. It when you go pour your bar kaya, I'm sorry you're sorry I'm bua for any of bar. And the brother on your way, you know, Bible say, a brother you go pour ball bar we the card and mono. Adam said, when me film party, when me born of flesh. She shall be what called a woman because there was a wound in a man. The God took something from a man. That is a wound. So the wound make what? A man. So he added to what? War versus what? Man. Making war man. War man. Because there was something that was taken war from a man. Making a woman. And after creating that woman, Adam named woman. This is what Adam said. For she was taken out of me. My goodness, Kabara told about. You understand? The woman was taken from a man. The Bible said, the Bible said, what God Almighty said, the Spirit of the Most High said, Adam was laying to rest. And Bible said, God took up something from Adam and used to create a woman. When God created that thing, God did not give a name to that thing. But the Bible says, when Adam wakes up from the, from the sleeping, he just stood up and said, this is a woman. This is what? A woman. This is a woman. And the woman represents a man. A man was created alone, without any part from anywhere. God just made a sun, a clay, and breath into it, and put blood into it, and said, this is a man I have created. After created a man, a man demanded for a woman. And the Bible says, as a man demanded for a woman, God said, Adam, you have requested for what you want and I will give it to you. And the Bible said, the heavens listen to Adams and they create another woman. After creating that thing, they did not give a name to that thing because Adam was the one who gave a name to those things. So when Adam wakes up from the sleeping, he said, this is my bone of flesh. And she will be called a woman. Man, woman, W O dash M A N, woman, because a man was made already, and they added woe unto it. Now, listen, woman, that's what Adam named a woman. That is what, and he said, That is my what, that is why a man leaves his what, father and mother, and what. Make a united with his wife and become what one flesh. Now, listen, this is what God wants, this is what God is asking from us, this is what God demanding from us. A man will leave his parent, a woman will leave his parent and join a man and become one flesh, then they become what one flesh. Not two again. As soon as you come married to your husband, as soon as you come married to your wife, as soon as you guys are becoming one, there's nothing called two. You become one. As soon as you are married to your husband, as soon as you are married to your wife, you become one, no more two. You think the same, you plan the same, you do everything the same. Now look at what the devil also decided to do to destroy marriage, which God has blessed Look at what the devil also planned against what God has planned. In every, every originality, there is a fake in it. In every original thing that has been made by God, there's always a fake that represents the devil. Now listen, the Matthew 19 verse 1, 19 verse 3. Some Pharisees, listen what the devil started. Some Pharisees went so Pharisees came to God when Jesus was on his mission. Some of the Pharisees came to Jesus and asked him. They asked, is it lawful for a man to divorce his wife for any and every reason? This is what the Bible says. The devil entered the Pharisees and gave them the hardened heart. 
to ask a question. And they ask Jesus Christ, eh yeah, so what's a mijama yere? A kwambi yasu. Nati yesu kos a kachin. Now rather kachin say, haven't you read um suyaye? That the beginning, the creator made them male and female. You get now Adam and Eve. The creator made them male and female. Share this on your wall. If you just join me, share this on your wall. The beginning, God creates male and female. And after creating them and said, For this reason, a man will leave his father and mother and be united to his wife. And the two will become what? One flesh. So now you see. When you are married to your wife, when you are married to your husband, you are no more two. You have no family. You have become one family. One people. One person. One single person. You have become that. And for that, you represent God. And that, you represent God. That is what Jesus answered the Pharisees. And the Pharisees keep on asking questions from God. They ask Jesus again. So they long, so, and, and, and Jesus continues saying, So they, they are no longer what two, but what? One flesh. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no one separate. This is what the Lord Jesus Christ said unto the Pharisees. Verse 7. They ask again, why then they why then they ask they ask Jesus again, why then Moses permitted you to divorce your wives because your hearts were what hardened. This was just Jesus will continue telling them why Moses gave them the law to divorce your wives? Because your heart is what hardened. You, the man walking out there, you like to chase everything. You like to follow everything. I was part like that. I was like that some years ago. I was part of this. When I didn't know Christ. When I thought I was doing the right thing. When I thought I was enjoying life. When I thought I was having the world in my hands. But when I realized that what I was doing was just like life of pain. Life of disappointment. Life of sorrow. I realized that no. I don't belong here. The Bible says to us that what God has joined together, no man should separate it. And you dare to separate it. Now listen. A man Those who are married have husbands. And they are still cheating. They are still WhatsApping other girl guys. When they are sleeping with their husbands on bed, when their husbands are sleeping, when their husbands are at work, when their husbands are not at home, when they are alone, that they are cheating on phone, WhatsApp, here and there, Facebook, content, Twitter, Instagram, Skype, Snapchat. I am telling you, you are committing your own suicide. You are digging your own pit and you fall into it. Because I'm going to show you what will happen to you. And the one who will marry a divorce or a divorcee, the implications that God is saying about you. Listen to me, my brother, my sister, my auntie, my mother, my father who are watching me. God did not support divorce. God did not support divorce or separation. Moses gave that permit. Moses gave that permit. And Jesus also accepted because the men were so hardened. Their hearts were so hardened. They were not willing to accept. They were not willing to, 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 to take what the Lord has said. They were just chasing things with their feelings, their enjoyment, their happiness. But they are forgotten that what God has said concerning their life was important. Listen to me, my brother, my sister, my auntie watching me. God tells us to marry, not to do boyfriend, girlfriends, not to have sex, not to have sex, and even 
after. Let me tell you. Do you know one thing? When somebody's on a bed having sex, sorry to say, having fun, having all that atrocity, adultery, he keeps on mentioning God's name. God damn it. You keep mentioning the name of most, the, the, the most high. Oh my God, oh my God, let me tell you, you are digging your own pit. Because the Bible says, those who are married, even those who are married after sex, do not mention God's name. He hmm? said, those who are married after sex, do not mention God's name. Why then are you mentioning the name whilst you're doing that atrocity? There's a lot to talk about, my brother, my sister, my auntie, my mom, my friend. Are you watching me? It's your brother. The lost soul who has been found home. God has brought me into the light. And I've seen everything that I was doing on earth. Everything that I was doing on that platform. I've seen all was sin. I lied to people. I said so many fake things to people. I have, I have done so many wrong things. I have had sex un, unprotected. I have had sex unneeded. Unnecessary things I have done with my life. And I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not scared of telling you. Because I have seen everything I have done will come to light. And my father will judge me on that day. Because he has said it unto me. Fornication. Adultery. It's a sin against God. It's a sin against Most High. It's a sin against the Messiah. And you, the Christian, you are doing it. You, the Christian, you are doing it. You, the believer, you are doing it. You call yourself a Christian, and what you're doing is to go out there, sleeping with men, sleeping with women, and all what you can do when you're doing it, you call the name of Messiah, you call the name of Jesus, you call the name of God. Oh my God, may God forgive you. Kibarabaraba. Let me tell you, my brother, my sister. I don't care how you see me. I don't care how you, you know me. I don't care whoever you are. But what I care is you will take the word of God and you will accept Christ and you will let Christ to take control of your life and you will stop doing these adultery things. Prostitution has become like a, a, a topic of the day. Now everybody's waiting for somebody to be naked so they can look at it and smile and laugh. Look at all those pages on the social media. Spicy, whatever, whatever, whatever. Every day somebody's naked and somebody use the nakedness to masturbate. My goodness. Let me tell you, my brother, my sister, there's no time to waste. Don't sit down there and say, I have done this, so God cannot forgive me. Let me tell you, the Bible makes it clear on Psalm 51 that God is able to forgive us our sins. Share this on your wall. If you join me, share this on your wall. The Lord made it clear to us that because of our sins, he sent his son to come and die for us. Jesus was sent to come and die to save your soul, to save your adulteries, to save your sins, to save your murder, to save the things that you have done against the king of the ruler. And now you are here. Instead for you to take that, that, that mantle and stand up and say, I will not go into it. You are now chasing it. My goodness. Second Corinthians 4 verse 4. I said, you are Message <laughs> One chin chin min panta mio. Sene nya mia jino. En nya no nini pa jino. Iye. Me sa wo shabre no wo shabre no. Sa wo fa nyan kropon. Wo ma Isaac nyan kropon. Wo ma Jacob nyan kropon. Wo ma Abraham nyan kropon. Wo ma Yahweh edin kuni mwa pura bo ma me se. E hounu ni betu. Aso chin ni bebo. O hao ni a chin chin ni beba. Ne ensu mo zaya god no. Oba kwa mao. 
And then we say, so one worry, now we're trying to cut it off. Worry no. Because I'm someone who can't afford no money. So no point. I'm so deep in water. I'm only a baby engineer. So I'm so what the sad in import. I'm quite a baby engineer. I'm only a baby engineer. She a brother who boy. Oba wale fo. She a brother who boy. Oba ma wale fo. She a brother who boy. Wa waja ya wari e. Na tiro dia wari e ne honsem. I'll say divorce. Matthew 5 verse 31. It talks about divorce. I'll say divorce or divorcee. The third one says. It has said. It has been said. Wa ka wana se mu se. Anyone who divorces his wife must give her a certificate for divorce. And no, yet the most is the Kaya or Yamuns and Pacuma Yetri, a different story. Nisabe, I won't say Yamabody and Tinosa is over a giant one. For certificates at all. And nothing as our warrior who hears our sign certificate. And nothing as our warrior who hears our cosign. Now, send me see ya. Now, when I want to me, now I sign. Now, what sign you and teach us? And don't put a most of them by an amount of mono. Sign common news one. And don't put your chasm. I said, the best thing to do, I said, but I tell you that anyone who divorces his wife, except Obia Ojani, I just say, I just say, TNE, I just say, Nipona Ede, what cause immorality, sexual immorality. Unless any pana upon Jamai, what be on Yanko Pons or Unquas or Jani, you know. Now, this certificate to put Jani, you know. I did say, when you put on a boy, my immorality sexual. Sexual immorality, pet. And I'm a person to me, Jawi, and I will come. A power of Sadia, my way. A power of Sadia, yes, who's to come once them. When young group walk out once them, may say, she knew what? A chess or Jawi. There's nothing that I give the opportunity, the authority, the audacity to divorce your wife or your husband. But because of our, our selfish, because of our greediness, you saw your wife beautiful and you married her. You saw your husband good, handsome, and you got married to him. But now you are growing up. You have seen a young guy who is so who has a muscles. You have seen a young girl who has a butt. You have seen a young girl who has a boobs. You have seen a young girl who has so many things that you like to enjoy. So you are leaving your wife. You are leaving your husband for that person. Let me tell you, you are causing your own grave. You are digging your own pit. But the Bible talks against it. Matthew verse five verse thirty one. It talks against it. It said, "Onipo betimi a giant." You know. I just saw what you are now going to abo a jamai, a jamai in Kutope. So who come forward? Chi, who is forward? Chi, I did everything you just saw. You are now going a jamai. But then they are here. Bear man, you need some kitu no ba pack in niema meko. I some kitu no bisi fear pe hey. I na meka wanfa. Eni sadam sme jawa niye. I soon die daho. I soon die kesi daho mau. Mami, I wash me. Auntie, I wash me. Sister, I wash me. Office where Jawa dey for our wedding. We catch your cousin there. We didn't send come up with your father. We won't call baby. We didn't mention the idea to us. Now, the one about what is any point? The one who has to change. Those who marry to divorce, those who marry to divorce and divorced. Those who marry to those who are divorced. Mama, we want to. Mama, we just want to come home. We don't want to meet the idea to move. We must meet the idea. I say make her. I say what? If you read the book of 30, 30, uh, thirty-two now, I say. But I tell you that anyone who divorces his wife, except for sexual immorality, makes her the victim of what adultery. And anyone who marries a divorced woman commits what adultery. Read it, my brother. God bless you for joining the Obi bia ya o wa ni obi ya onwa jawa ni yeno wo u koso adultery. Anybody who, who helps someone to divorce, you have caused adultery. Assuming the person is married, 
and because of all your officer, all your boss, our Juma Munti. Also, I know my secretary Sika. That's a cut you fall in love now. Near Connie, but near Connie, but no one called Jawa. Who's our secretary? You know, and no me do what she's a winning one. Uncle Wajai. What's our secretary? No, and no me our first one, so winning one, Uncle Wajai. What's our Bayana? What do you be crew? I was on to one channel, ma. One should have been for no Saba, you know. Yeah, ready because on Yanko Pozo said Pozo committed adultery. Obi a jar, you know. Obi, or no proper crowns to this as if the next Yanko Papa to us, I will die your own pet. When your members are just our retire on your day, one pet. And no be out here, now on your bill called that, anyhow. Sex has become a food for the day. Now, up here, everybody wake up in the morning and start to see somebody's nakedness. Kaba tosso reba. Libra boko tosso reba. Yeah, so when you need the air cause, you see, oh, my catch or say, show up, brother, who boy ye. Shed is on your wall. Show up, what brother, who born, shed ye. My master, my master, my professor, my woo. No, 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 no. I am not here to prophesy on you. I am not here to give you money. I am not here to read a scripture. Thou will allow you to give me money. But I'm here to give you kings. I am here to lash you. I am here to straighten you. I am here to let you know what you have to do with your life. You, the man who are divorcing your wife, what you have to do. You, the lady who are divorcing your man, who what you have to go through. And after your divorcee, what will happen to you? The Bible says, whoever married a divorcee or a divorced person also commit adultery. Because, say, so, wow, if you did not marry that person, or if you did not go out with that person, no matter what, they will roam and roam and roam later, they will come back. They will come back and join again. That's what the Bible says. Whatever the Lord has joined together, no man should put what asunder. May no man separate it. But then, Obi Wale Saturday came with ya. Koshe, and Friday, Ojina, Register General, Okujaya Wari. One will to me. Obi Wale, just last Saturday, Monday, got divorced. Would my dear don't want to? Do you know what you are carrying on your head? Let me tell you, my brother, my sister, my auntie who are watching me. I said, the pastors, your pastors, your prophet and prophetess, they will not tell you the truth of the gospel. They only want your money because the Bible talks about it. The, the, the book of Micah 3 verse 9 to 30. He said they preach for money. They only preach for money. And you that, you that people who are building the house of the Lord with the bloodshed, who are building with the greedy money, who are building, who teach and preach for money. I am not here for money. I am here to tell you, my brother, my sister, to know what you have to do. The time has come. They have to know that as a time is coming, you will not have the chance to stand anywhere and say sorry. But the time is now. You have to rise up and say, God, forgive me my sin. God, I have committed adultery. God, immorality, sexuality, I've been into it. God, forgive me. And he will forgive you. He will forgive you. He will forgive you. Or say, dear word, ya wari no. Na wa wo kwa kwa wari no no. Se wo ye oba na kwa wari be ma no. Wo ye be ma na kwa wari oba no. Wo nso wo ko so adultery. Na kamide fa me ho be. What is my problem? What do I care? Somebody has got divorced, and I want to marry that person. What crime have I committed? I don't know. I think I have not committed any crime against this, because. They decided to divorce and they have signed divorce and they are gone. So the role is there for me to play. But listen to what about the, the, the Bible said in the book of Matthew 5, verse 32. I said, He said, Listen very careful. But I tell you that no anyone who divorces his wife except what? Sexual immorality makes her the victim of what? Adultery. Sexual morality is more by adultery. I never meant to be a jar. I don't want you to be a bad in China, be a man in China. I don't want you to be a TDA. I don't want you to be a TDA. What do you want to do? I don't want you to be a TDA. I don't want you to be a TDA. I don't want you to be a TDA. I don't want you to be a free baby. I don't want you to be a Connecticut. I don't want you to be a TDA. I don't want you to be a TDA. 
wote Philadelphia ametegana ana ana ujira jao ho wote wote uh, Norfolk in Nebraska ana memete kumase ana mebe ware wo wote we be Manchester meti Hefa meti California meba be ware wo me Netherlands u Australia ye be ware we jao ware ye na mebe ware wo mini pana mini mu ho she no me me koso adultery sa won tia fa ba ibo na ridi sa won tia me kan asia pick your bible and read If you don't understand, pick your Bible and read. And then make a chill. Any idea made a make a chill. The one who is coming to marry you, you will see. The other one who are with Jawa, you know. You have a problem. The man has a problem. The girl has a problem. And especially, more and more worry. Now, I'm sorry, I want to guide you. Hey, this guy has a muscles. This guy is, a, this guy gets swag. This lady is a beautiful girl. This girl got money. My wife is poor. My wife is that. My husband is that. Let me divorce my husband. Let me divorce my wife. My husband is telling me. He always complain. My wife complain. My wife this and that. So let me divorce him. Let me follow this girl. Let me follow this man. Let me tell you. The Bible said to you. You are going to cause adultery. You have to stop. You have to stop. You have to stop. After swearing an oath, when the Bible talks about it, do not swear. But when you're on the altar, you hold the mic and the Bible and say, I do swear that I will take him as my husband, my wife, whether rain or shine, unless death depart us. And the death did not depart you. In three days, you go to court and you're seeking for divorce. In three days, you go to court and you are seeking for divorce. After getting your divorce, do you know what you have put yourself into? And you better say, a bet me and can you day, ma and worry. And you the book of Matthew 5 and 30 say, and again, you have heard that it was all said to the people long ago, do not break your oath, but fulfill. To the Lord, the, the vows you have what? Made. Do not break the vows that you have vowed. Share this on your wall. Do not what? Hide. Or do not break the vow that the Lord you have stood in front of. You holding the Bible and said, I will take him as my husband. It's only death that will depart us. And tomorrow you are going to court and sigh and say, I have divorced him. Let me tell you, you are digging your own pit. You are digging your own world grave early. Because the Bible made it clear to us. The king of the universal changer, the controller, the Lord of Lords, did not support divorce, adultery, fornications. How many days in a week and I have a sex? We are one worry here. Now we can Now me can hubi. Me now me can I was one. But let me tell you, I have seen, and I always cry. I always cry because that's not what I wanted. I messed up. But God said to me, my son, this is why I am picking you out. To go out there. Let them know. Because they know how bad you used to be. They know who you were. They know what you put yourself into. How you were chasing people out there. Here and then. Drinking, going pop clubs, beach, and travel to have fun. But today, you are going to be a testimony. You are going to be a result to change somebody. But if God bless you too. I don't have anything for you. I can't offer you money. I can prophesy on your life, but God has not given me the opportunity to prophesy. I am not a prophet. I am your brother, evangelist. I speak the truth of the gospel. I know it's going to hurt you. I know it's going to damage you. I know <laughs> this is going to Give you a pain. But the pain killer is this. In the Bible. What's the young country? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Say. I say. A new one say. Who break your oath. 
I have a swear on Yanko Pony. But I also offer Phyllis our own to know Owen Yamian. Verse 34. But I tell you, do not swear an oath at all, either by heavens, for it is God's word throne, or by the earth, for it is the it is what his foot stool, or by Jerusalem, for it is the city of the what Greek king, and do not swear by your head, for you cannot make even one hair white or what black. Somebody will stoop and say, hey, I swear I didn't do this. I swear, let me tell you. It's a vow. It's an altar. It's a commitment. It's something that you're doing against God in heaven. And he said, it's a crime. It's a sin. And you got to stop, my brother, my sister. So there's no need for you to go to a, a church and make a wedding. And after doing the wedding, holding the Bible and swearing and vowing. And later, the next day, we will see you divorcing your husband. Because you have seen a young guy. Because somebody is giving you vibes. Somebody is giving you words. Somebody is portraying you with, with, with a sweet love words. What your husband used to do. But because of things that you have stopped doing for him. I worry for. And then. I'm on you. The marriage people, the couples, which make one, with the Bible says, what God has drawn together, may no man separate it. Why then are we fighting a little issue, a man will say, I am going to give you divorce. Especially, most divorce come from women. But I don't, you know, I'm sweating, I'm in that but I swear, I swear to you, I'm always sweating. Okay, my icon is on, but I still am sweating. In 17, but I'm still sweating because what? The power, the energy, I have not eaten since morning till now. I have not eaten, but the energy, the strength that my father has given to me is more than food. Moses went to the mountains, Mount Sinai, and prayed 40 days, 40 nights. He came back with empty stomach without a food. He got peace and threw out the Ten Commandments. And the Bible said, the Lord said to him, I will give it to you again. He went there 40 days, 40 nights, 80 days, and came back with a law. He did not eat him. So my day, since one time I'm not eating, it's nothing. It's nothing. But I'm here to give you nothing but the best of Christ. The truth. I know it's bitter. It, you, 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 your tongue is now what making you like you're eating um, what, a bitter toffee but it's the truth it's what it's the truth it is in the bible it is written that a man will leave his family mother and father and a woman will leave his family parent and join and become one flesh and may no man no pastor, no, 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 no counselor, nobody should separate it. But tomorrow by this time, they, tomorrow as I'm talking to you, some people are going to call to marry. Monday, they will turn around and say they want to divorce. May God see you through. And let me tell you, if you are a guy and you are going to marry to a divorcee, beware. If you are a man and you are going to marry to a lady who has just divorced or who has divorced. Only if the husband is dead. For that one, we can consider. Because the Bible says only the dead can separate the two. What
Wawari. Now a secretary. And Adnaya will chopping board. Every day. Um, me and office. Born in our year, Secretary, no, so the audio was so dear, dear. Winning one, copper, biafa. Secretary, no, was so check as yet, dear. So winning one, and copper, biafa. What up with the younger party? Now what did I Pool party. Now I come out, got your bathroom. Now I have a sex. What implications are all home? It's a young quala, one son, tiasem, or bonnet for them quala, friendly from Bassas. So, seven of a teen, I mean, Bathroom no have sex. Na answer no ban in him. Men kwa ya bossy, kwa ya bossy, men kwa ya bossy, kwa ya bossy. No ban na wo. Akwa ni ebon eba. Wo ye musuo. I was part of it. Na me jimeni pa. Kwa se se me jimeni pa. I am not disputing the fact that I was, I was, I was not a, I was a sinner. I was a serious sinner. Mwa ne chemi. Ebi ya o chemi, nimdi na o de chemi. Na me jimeni pa, na me pema pa. Ben na me tu me tu na chile ose me, me. Di adoba shi ya sinem fa me shi ya se. If se nyami di kan kan chile me. Ose na me prepare wo. Edi ama me own use. I was preparing you for my own use. So what join out there share wo one mati? And some di e e babi bri. So wo unfollow me so I share no bin so like it. Na obi sun ti a same ready. Se o read the book of Matthew 5 verse 30, 33. Echo ko si 37 now. I say and he said unto them. And do not swear by the, by your head for you cannot make what even one hair or one hair black or white. All you need to say is simply yes or no. Anything beyond this comes what from the evil one. Or Peter was swear, I just swear before and upon some they used to know. Me enough for. Look at me. I'm wet. The the power, the Holy Spirit is upon me right now. And I'm talking to you as a brother. Listen to me. If you are married, if you are married, a man or a woman, please never seek for divorce. Never in your life seek for divorce. What you need is Christ. When the temptation comes, when the troubles comes, God did not test us. When you are on your own, you are on your own. When you are on your own, you are on your own. It's in the Bible. God never tests us faith, our faith. God, he never tests us our faith. He only tests. The only person who tests us is the devil. He will put fear and panic in you. He will let you to feel that you are inferior. God will not need you. So don't go close to God. And you scared going to cross. You think if you cross to God, you will die. But let me tell you, crossing to Christ is a salvation. Crossing to Christ is a time of what? Everlasting life. Crossing to Christ is to know what you have to do. Crossing to Christ is to save your soul. But staying where you are. Being a stagnant. In the devil's incantation, in the devil's uh, 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 bad and things, let me tell you, you belong there and the fire, hellfire, will be away for you. And he said, but since sexual immorality is, is what? Occurring. Each man should have what sexual relationship relations with his one wife, his own wife, and each woman with her own what husband. The husband should what fulfill his marital duty to his wife, and likewise the wife to, to her husband. The wife does not have what authority over her own body, but what yield it to her husband. In the same way, the husband does not have what authority over his own what body, but yells it to his wife. Listen to me. This point is a key for you. You the marriage, you you you, you the guy who are married just last week. You the lady who just got married. This is to you. The body that God has given to you, that you just got married to that young guy, that you just got married to that young lady, does not belong to you anymore. It belongs to each other. 
You guys belong to each other. You need not to hide your feelings from each other. You need not to run away from each other. In a night you wear boxer shorts. In a night you wear skinny jeans. In a night you wear trousers. And sleep with your husband on the bed. Let me tell you, you are calling for divorce. And when that thing happens, the Lord Almighty will judge you. Stay away from divorce. Stay away from sexual immorality. Stay away from fornication. Stay away from adultery. I did not know. I was not aware. I heard it. But I did not see it. I did not believe it. Until the Lord revealed that my son, you got to read this. This is why I called you. This is what you have to do. This is what I appointed you for. And you got to tell the people to change and walk away from the evil atrocities, from the thing that they are doing, from the adultery to the immorality, the thing that they are doing against me, my king. I am warning you, tell them to walk away because that is the world changing pillar. The devil is using that point. It's not because I'm proud. Even if I'm proud, I'm proud because God loves me. Even if I'm proud, I'm proud because God loves me. Yes. If I'm proud, I'm proud because God loves me. Prepared for me. He loves me. I will not. It, like I will not tell you to go into marry and divorce. So many of your pastors are not telling you about the consequences of divorce, about the consequences of adultery, about the consequences of immorality. About the consequences of divorce. They only tell you, 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 you make it through. I prophesy on you. You will make money. You will enjoy the kingdom. You will have your house. You will have your car. You will have your marriage. You will have this. Let me tell you, I mentioned marriage. Oh, but marriage, do you? Busan is say. Oh, no. I did not tell you marriage anymore. I saw from one day here. I saw the man. I saw the man. I saw the man. I saw the man. I saw and I want one more dad of Yara. And don't think one more sorry, but in a man in a position, you know, of it. You know, when you're from on the night, friend say, or prepare a formal gate, no, no. Then who offended my office? Said your bay, yeah, who bet me and me and me, I know. But I'm telling you, also from three, maybe I'm also. And then I'm a time, and they divorce for. And they are worried, and they are the giant for us. And next time, next week, you know, a bay, I'm more worried, I'm more. But I'm telling you, my brother, my sister, who are watching me today, I am not here for fun. I cannot go and commit me idea, commit me crazy things. Now come here, Jimmy Dean. But me wa me ni yangu pumoni a pambiara. But se se ya no, me prepare me home, me prepare wo. Na wo swa mu no kure, na wo juani fribone hong. Wo ni ben man nante. Five years, six years, mon worry ye, de be our doubts on a pine, a pine, a pine, and two who say what you're born. When you buy a young worry ye, de be your toes, and I pine, a pine, and two who say one worry ye, de be our wooden go for you no much, and two who say about no worry, de be our go for cool much, and two who say about no worry. Oh, Kaba toes on the bala, Libra Katos on the bala. Jesus, you are speaking through the soul which was rejected. Yes, God. Sometimes when I see things I've been through, what people are going through, God, it made me feel like even say what you want me to say because I am not going to say lie to you. You have to change. My brother, you have to change. My sister, you have to change. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me and I'm speaking with you with tears. I am telling you, you are changing people's husband. You are changing people's wife. You are doing this adultery. Immorality is why I'm becoming part of you. You got to walk out from it. Walk out. Change. God don't like it. He don't need you to do that. He created you 
for one man, one person. You've been doing this for years upon years upon years and you don't know to stop. Why? Why is obeying the rules that God gave to you? Why are you committing so much sin? Why? Why can't you just wake up one day and say, God, take me for who I am. Make the use of me. Instead, you walk out in the morning looking for food you eat, using your body for money. God damn it. Sometimes I feel so hurt when I know that this is what the Lord was talking about. And so many pastors are not telling you, but they are supporting you to keep on. You go to pastor and tell pastor, my boyfriend, God, my boyfriend is cheating on me. Hey, do you know what that is? Do you know God support that or not? And you call yourself a Christian. May God forgive you. May God forgive you. May God forgive you. May God really forgive you because you don't know what you are doing. You don't have idea what you are doing. You don't know what you're going through. If you know you walk away from those things, God has nothing to offer you. He has nothing to offer you than pains and sorrows. It's only one to disgrace you. It's only one to despite you to end up in hellfire. I am not my real hope. So now I'm saying, I'm not going to be 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 saying, I'm not going Same when you're meeting me in here. What ye? It be an out the only minia de my inibi. Nina me at you. As do not deprive each other, except perhaps by mutual what consent and for a time so that you may what devote yourself to prayer. So when you marry, you need to be together. Pray to God. Ask God. If things are not working, sit with your husband, your wife, and pray to God. Tell God, this is not who we are. We started with happiness. We started with, with joy. We enjoy your kingdom when we're not married. God, now we are married. Things are tearing apart. God, we want you. Pray with your husband and your wife. And if there's any, any contractor that has an assigned to destroy your marriage, God will put that person in shame. Because God loves marriage. He doesn't support and punching. Unyango pong on support him and punching. Unyami on support to a a a jamam bo. A jamai unyami support to. Oh, you na fa yirechi. Oh, kuna fa kunechi. A baya unyimiye and puna mema be ten five na kikamboso. And the WhatsApp aba oda be man chanda to silence. Namu de monchi meba. Next week meba. Next week mo be numo. Next week is for single. Next week, Friday, is for singles. Tonight, my friend is having um, a watch night at Medina Presby Church. And I will be there. I want you to be there. Enjoy the grace. And enjoy the grace, the kingdom that we are fighting for. If you read Ephesians 5 verse 22, Wives, submit yourself to your own husbands as you do to what? To the Lord. 23, For the husband is the head of the wife as Christ is the, what? the head of the church. His body of which he is the Savior. Now as the church submits to Christ, so also wives should what? submit to their husbands. 
in everything. Husband, love your wives just as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for it for her. So I have this topic that I'm going to share with you one day about women. Women never love the only what like what you have. Women never love. They are sub people that God said they should, they should submit to you. If you read the Bible, there's no place God said, women love your, your, your husband. Never. It says, woman, wife, submit to what? To your husband. And a man, love your wife. As Christ, love what? The church. So a woman is like a church. As the church submits to the people who are worshipping to it. And a man is the one who stands on the altar and preach. So if you love something, you won't destroy it. If you love your wife, you will not go and cheat on him, on her. Please, let's learn to know that God did not support divorce. And some of Kafa has chapter in on HS on Yango Pon and support our Jaye. Says from Genesis 2, verse 18. Basically, Matthew 19, verse 3 to 12. Matthew 5, verse 31 to 32. Matthew 5, 33, verse 37. Ebabes Ephesians 22. Ebabes Hebrew 13, verse 4. God did not talk about divorce. He only goes against it. In every angle of what the Lord was talking about, it's all about condemning it. Divorce, God never loves it. So if you are here and you are thinking of divorce, please, I am telling you, stop. There will be no benefit for you. Wa wa jawa ni nzo wa ubi befa wano. Oh man, say ni pana baye bone. Wa wa wari. Na ube jai ukunu ana uja wa yirino. Eni pana woko fana ni pana befa wano. Eni pana nzo ba be komete bone. Oba baye bone. Eti ni yangu pani muniyam. It's two things involved. That means God don't want us to divorce when we are married. So please know who you want to marry, who you want to set up and spend the rest of your life with. Don't just jump into any guy's bed, any lady's arm, because the guy has money, has cars. Because the lady works well, he has a good job. Because the lady is beautiful, because she's, she's attracted to you. No! That is not what the Bible says. Seek thy kingdom first, and the rest shall add unto you. May you be blessed. And always bless. You can always worship with me. Word of God Ministry. The BOGM. Word of God Ministry. You can join me every Sunday at East Legon American House, 69 Road, at Jingano. You can join me every Sunday, 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. And every Wednesday, you can join me on Oxy 98.5. Every Wednesday, Oxy 98.5. From 8 a.m. to 10 a.m., I'll be your host. I will be your host and I'll be there to wait for your course and your understanding to this whole thing. You can join me on Oxy 98.5 every Wednesday, 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. And your life will never be the same. And after the, after the online or the, the radio teachings, I'll be sitting down at Hachu, Hachu Yam Market, Hachu Yam Market, where the big church that we're establishing is. You can join us to worship and pray. If you have any sickness, any diseases on your body, just come. We will pray with you and we will ask God to forgive you. If there's a sin you have committed, God will forgive you. And if you need any herbal medicines, God will use us to give it to you. May you be blessed and may you enjoy the kingdom of the Lord. I am here as your brother and your friend, your son, your child. May God bless you for your time watching me. May you be blessed and enjoy the kingdom of God. If you want to call me, <clears throat> if you want to talk to me, <clears throat> if you want to have a personal discussion with me, if you want to share something with me, it may be the video I did, something went wrong that you want to correct me, you can call me 
If you want to share anything with me, maybe the video, something was not good to you. Or maybe you want to know more about what I'm saying, about all what I'm telling you. Maybe you know me to be a bad person. <clears throat> and now you have seen a change in me. You can send me WhatsApp on the same line. You can call me and we will talk. You can call me and come for prayers and we will pray. And the Lord reveals something to me, I will tell you. I am not a prophet. But the Lord said, I should go to the word, speak the word of God, baptized into the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Those who believe God will accept and be baptized. So, if you want to join my, my, my prayer camp or my prayer meeting, you can join me Word of God ministry at Jungano Road every Sunday, 5 p.m. After your church, after your children, everything, come and let's pray. Or you can meet me on, on Wednesday, 4 to 7 p.m. at Hachuya Market, and your life will never be the same. God bless you for your time being spent with me, for your time and also your effort for waiting. Your comments are all welcome. You can keep sharing this on your wall and let somebody also be a partaker. Thank you for watching me. God bless you and stay blessed. Bye-bye.